Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah, bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalatu wassalamu ala sayyidul anbiya wal mursalim. Rabbi shirah li sadri wa yassir li amri wa harul uqdatan min lisani yafqaw qawli. Exis Medical School viewers there, Shagatom. তাদের জন্য আজকে এই প্রথম লেকচার লেকচারের বিষয়বস্তু হলো ইন্ট্রোডাকশন অ্যান্ড হিস্টোরিক্যাল ব্যাকগ্রাউন্ড অফ মাইক্রোবায়োলজি শুরুতেই আমরা একটি ভাইরাল ডিজিজ মাইক্রোবায়োল ডিজিজ দিয়ে শুরু করি করোনা ভাইরাস যেটি এখন সবার মুখে মুখে এ পর্যন্ত করোনা ভাইরাসে এক কোটি ছাব্বিশ লক্ষ বাহান্ন হাজারের বেশি লোক আক্রান্ত হয়েছে এবং তার মধ্যে পাঁচ লক্ষ তেষট্টি হাজার চারশো অষ্টআশি জন ইতিমধ্যে মারা গিয়েছে মাইক্রোবায়োলজি ইজ দ্য সায়েন্স অফ স্টাডি অফ মাইক্রো অর্গানিজমস অ্যান্ড মাইক্রো অর্গানিজমস দ্যাট ক্যান বি সিন অনলি উইথ মাইক্রোস্কোপ মাইক্রো অর্গানিজমস ক্যান বি প্রেজেন্ট ইন এয়ার সয়েল ওয়াটার অ্যানিম্যাল হিউম্যান বডি এভরি হায়ার ইউ ক্যান সি এভরি হায়ার দিয়ার আর মাইক্রোস অ্যান্ড in the air there are few microbes but in the garden soil even in the human skin there are 10 to the power 6 microorganisms per square centimeter in human mouth 10 to the power 7 per ml human intestine 10 to the power 10 per gram uh, first bacteria appeared 3.5 billion years ago and microorganisms Mostly, they are beneficial to human beings. Only a few cause disease. And medical microbiology really concerned with the pathogenic microorganisms. These are the places where microorganisms reside. In our body, many sites are full of microbes. Only a few sites are sterile. And friendly bacteria always fights with the unfriendly or pathogenic bacteria and they protect us from diseases. So most of the bacteria are never pathogenic, many bacteria are potentially pathogenic and few bacteria are always pathogenic. So what is microbiology and medical microbiology? Medical microbiology is that branch of medical science that deals with the microbes causing disease, the ways they produce disease, diagnosis, their treatment, host response against the microbes, and prevention. Microbe size varies from few micron to many meters. And branches of microbiology, medical microbiology includes bacteriology, parasitology, mycology, virology, and immunology. And clinical microbiology or infectious disease is a, different, is a new branch of medical microbiology. This is most important for the physicians and clinicians. Microbes, disease and history. Pathogens, they are diseases. There are more than 2,000 different microbes that cause disease in human body. In a year, 10 billion infections occur, of which 15 million dies. Microbial disease in the past and present. Different times, different microbial diseases used to be prevalent. For example, in the 14th century, leprosy, 15th century, plague, 16th century, syphilis, 17th and 18th century, smallpox, in the 19th century, TB, measles and scarlet fever, AIDS in the 20th century, and COVID in the 21st century. <clears throat> Plague in 14th century killed about 25 million in Europe. And in 1894 to 1896, in two years, 10 million people were killed by plague. Influenza killed more than 20 million in 1880 to 1819. Recursial disease, 3 million died, 50 million infected. Cholera, 
there are many pandemics of which five from india during the period of 60s mortality rate from cholera was about 50% but in the 90s 1993 only less than 2% due to discovery of oral saline hiv aids discovered in 1986 and till now 15 million 50 million people are infected and more than 16 million died by the year 2000 tuberculosis a most important infectious disease every year 100 million people are infected and in bangladesh also 10 to 20 million suffers from tb and 2 to 3 million dies hepatitis b virus there are 400 to 500 million carriers and 10 lakh people die every year and from covid 1.2 crore infected of which 5.5 lakh died these are the graphical representation of the infectious disease you can see respiratory infections are most common followed by diarrheal disease and tuberculosis and the covid is also a respiratory pathogen so major microbial disease Uh, varies in different centuries you can see and in 21st century this is covid in one day 1 lakh 37000 adults and 1 lakh 64000 children stay home because of the common cold diarrheal disease kills 27000 of americans not killed 27000 of americans become sick due to food poisoning and std about 2700 americans discovered that they have gonorrhea and globally on 11 july 1 lakh 83000 confirmed cases of covid-19 including 4502 deaths this is the report of who you see death from microbial disease every year about 31% of total deaths are due to infectious disease of which respiratory tract infections are most common history of microbiology microbe discovered more than 300 years before but known to man during the mid mean mid 1800s antony van leeuwen hook was the first to describe bacteria by discovery of microscope other people they believed that living organisms could develop and experimental phase leven hook pastor cock and lisher they contributed in the field of medical microbiology this is the antony van leeuwen hook's microscope and the figure he drew by his microscopic findings and his microscope could magnify objects about 200 to 300 times so leven hook was the first person to discover microscope and the presence of bacteria and spirochetes in the mouth during the 17 to 18th century there were fight between spontaneous generation and to disprove it 1718 lady mary montagu introduced a smallpox variolation at from turkey to england which was followed by edward jenner and in 19th century men lost their fear of god and acquired a fear of microbes ignaz schmalweis first Hungarian physician he published the etiology concept and prophylaxis of childbirth fear during the similar period john snow showed that cholera is spread by contaminated water louis pasteur considered as the founder of modern microbiology who discovers disproves spontaneous generation theory 
Robert Koch was con is considered the father of the medical virology. He was the doctor with the microbiology background. He discovered mycobacterium tuberculosis, vibrio cholera, and solid media. Paul Ehrlich discovered the arsenic compound known as magic bullet. Hans Christian Gram, Gram staining. Bone bearing cutasado, antitoxin from bacterium tetanus. Louis Pasteur, uh, who is considered as the founder of modern microbiology, has many contributions. This proves spontaneous generation theory, invented, invented pasteurization fermentation, positive presence of anthrax, rabies, and live attenuated vaccine, anti rabies vaccine. Final proof of recognition of disease by microbes was established by Robert Koch. And he used the criteria developed by his teacher, Jacob Henley, and he contributed regarding pure culture in solid media, Cox postulate, Cox phenomenon, the isolated bacillus anthracis, mycobacterium tuberculosis, and cholera bacilli during 1876 to 1892. This is the golden period of medical microbiology. He developed various techniques for studying microbial pathogen, of which development solidifying agent, the agar, petri dish, which are nowadays used, and everybody of us know, blood agar, chocolate agar, etc. There is a story of Fanny Hesse and Alter Hesse regarding the discovery of agar. Fanny Hesse was the wife of Walter Hesse, a student of Koch, who suggested use of agar for solidification of bacteria media. Koch's postulate consisted of four things. You know, the same microorganism must be present in every case of disease, must be isolated in pure culture. From the pure culture, it must cause the region experiment element, animal, and from the experimental animal, Again, the same identical organism must be isolated. Joseph Lischer, he introduced aseptic surgery by using carbolic acid. Paul Ehrlich, as we said before, discovered the synthetic arsenic compound, also known as magic bullet in 1880. Elimus, you know, Mesnikov, phagocytic and humoral antibody was discovered by von Bering. Lady Mary Montagu introduced variolation from Turkey to England. This is discussed in elaborately in the immunology lecture. Golden age of microbiology. In the golden age of microbiology, there were discovery of many diseases advances in the understanding of immunity, and advances in the understanding of microbial metabolism. Fermentation pasteurization or, or innovation of Louis Pasteur. Germ theory of disease were disproved by Augustine of Bessy, John Snow, Louis Pasteur, and germ theory of disease was proposed by Augustine of Bessy, John Snow, Louis Pasteur, and Robert Koch. Alexander Fleming discovered penicillin from the growth of molds. And this was a discovery by chance. He left some plates in the laboratory bench and which he found after a week that some fungus grew in the bacterial plate. And this fungus cleared the bacterial growth. This is the, that fungus was known as penicillium. So penicillin is the product came from fungus. During the second golden age, 1943 to 1970, microbial genetics and understanding the molecular rule of DNA and recombinant DNA technology were known to human being by use of microbes, especially E. coli. 20th century, there are many discoveries. Alexander Fleming, penicillin, Howard Florey, use of penicillin to drug. 
uh, every MacLeod and McCarty, the DNA is the genetic material. Watson Creek proposed DNA structure. Lock Montagner and Robert Gallo, HIV as the positive agent of AIDS. Barry J. Marshall and Warren Robin. Compiler vector pylori from peptic ulcer disease. And first complete gene genetic sequence of bacterium is published in 1995. And use of immunology to identify some bacteria and their serotyping was proposed by Rebecca Lansfield in 1933. In 1958, WHO declares two set smallpox globally, which finally begins in 1967 and eradicated in 1977. And you know the smallpox vaccine was discovered back in 1896. So it took 150 years after the discovery to use this vaccine for the benefit of mankind. And within 10 years, the smallpox was declared officially eradicated. Last case seen in Somalia in 1977. Another important uh, discovery was the electron microscope by Ernest Ruska. And these are some selected Nobel Prizes in Microbiology and Immunology. It started from the very beginning, 1901, von Berry for diphtheria toxin, Ross for malaria transmission, Robert Koch for discovery of microbacterium tuberculosis, Mesnikov phagocytosis, Fleming Chain and Flory for discovery and use of penicillin, Waxman for use of streptomycin, Tonegawa for antibody genetics, Marshall and Warren for H. pylori, Lock Montagnier and Frank Berry, HIV AIDS. And uh, I like to pay homage to our Bangladeshi scientist, Professor Dr. Kaji Abul Mansur, who discovered Mansur's media. And this is, this is me. This picture was taken in 1986. Lastly, I like to share some philosophy of life. To be your best self, to change your world, you must change yourself. To blame and complain will only make matters worse. Whatever you care about is your responsibility. What you see in others shows yourself. See the best in others, you will be your best. Give to others and you give it, give to yourself. Appreciate beauty and you will be beautiful. Admire creativity and you will be creative. Love and you will be loved. Seek to understand and you will be understood. Listen and your voice will be heard. Teach and you will learn. Show your best face to the mirror and you will be happy with the face looking back at you. So success and scopes of microbiology and immunology includes diagnosis, treatment, eradication, prevention of disease, organ transplantation, food and pharmaceutical industry, agriculture, molecular biology, genetic engineering, biotechnology, etc. These are the some of the important events in the development of microbiology. You, you can go through in details. It started from 1546 to till date. Rabbi Jid Nelma, Kayamar Bhutapalo, Kamadhyan Bariyadin. And lastly, the take home messages. Number one. Microbes came in this world 3.5 billion years before and present everywhere. Most of the microbes are beneficial and some are necessary and only a few are harmful, harmful for human beings. Every year, 10 billion infections occur and from out of which 1.5 crores die from microbial infections. History of microbiology started with collective efforts. So Leeuwen Hook laid the first stone, then Louis Pasteur and Robert Koch explored it. 
in the field of immunology, Lady Montagu, Edward Jenner, Mesnikov, and Von Bering. They are the founders. In the parasitology, Levin Hu, Patrick Manson, Charles Donovan, Lishman, Ronald Ross. In the field of virology, Damitri Ivanovsky, Sevin, Sak, Lachman Tegner, the chemotherapy, Paul Arlip, Tomac Alexander Fleming should be mentioned. Wish you all the best. Thank you very much.